Well, Slavin, two points from the last two games and just one goal conceded in those two games as well. Your side is becoming a lot more resilient. I'm guessing that that's pleased you. Yeah, it pleased me. And uh, we played good against Brighton. Still, we had that black hole second part of the first half. Uh, but uh, we started well. Then in the second half, we we started really well. And last half an hour, we were. it was one of our best performances. I think the best half an hour after the lockdown, uh, so including the championship. So uh, I'm very pleased with our reaction. I'm very pleased the way we played and I'm, uh, uh, we're still waiting for the first win. Yeah, but we are, we are, we are getting points. We are growing as a team. We are, we are erasing or deleting those little question marks that, that players that has a rookie that have a rookie season in in this uh, this year this season are having basically and the best way to get rid of them or to or to reduce them is is by playing good by collecting uh, points by proving themselves individuals as as a team against against those players from the premier league and uh, it's a learning process but uh, we are we are doing well you spoke about getting that first win just how much of a confidence booster and what would it do for the belief of this squad and the football club to get that on Monday at Fulham? Ah, it would be great, of course, uh, no matter that we have. I mean, uh, when, when we talk about it, then we think uh, it's missing here. No, we are. We are a very confident group. We are in a positive situation. We are, we are a positive group of uh, people uh, because we saw in every game that 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 apart from Southampton, I always say that we are good enough. We have just to stretch that period, and that uh, of course there are many teams that are more quality on the paper, but we can play them. Last couple of games, it wasn't only that that you can be competitive, that you can compete, that you have a chance. Last couple of games, you were like at least 50-50 with the opponent, you know, uh, in ball possession, in number of shots, in number of that, number of that. So that gives you the, that makes the group really positive. And because it's actually, hap it's not me talking to them, you can do it. It's actually happening on the pitch in the Premier League. So we are, we are, we are growing as a team. Uh, and uh, we want to continue this, this, this little series that we have. Fulham, a side that we'll know plenty about, two games, two draws against them last season. What kind of test are you expecting on Monday? Again, you know, last season it was very, very, very little different between the teams. Uh, so I'm expecting the same. They are looking for the first win. They are, they are below us, you know. Uh, uh, they, are, they were very active. In a transfer window, they brought a lot of players who basically started, I think, in their last game against Palace. It was only three players that played in a championship. All the others are new players. And so they maybe they need gel. Uh, they, they need time to gel together. But uh, I'm expecting, again, a very tough game of two teams that are going to do everything. And they're looking towards that game with uh, hoping that it's going to be a little bit of a, a good chance for for them and us to get the first win. Dara missed the game at Brighton on Monday. Is there any update on his fitness? Is he? Is Dara he is better? good. Dara is good. Dara is. Uh, Dara trained with us today. What is today's first day? Yeah. He trained with us today. Uh, as I said in the beginning, it looked more like like uh, it's gonna be the injury that's gonna take him longer. Uh, on the so sidelines, but thank God it's not. Uh, and he's back, he's back, he done today training completely, 100%, so he should be okay. So we're in a good shape, we're in a good moment uh, regarding the injuries. It's only Hal Robson and Samfield who are out, they should be both of them. Hal came today, first time since the injury and the surgery to the training ground, it looks good. And uh, both of them should be back uh, after the international week.